Welcome back, Alex. Do you want to talk about your time in Colorado? Let's start with something positive. What did you learn from your visit to Haven Springs? I thought I learned what it means to make a place your home. That must have felt like quite the victory. Let's talk about how it feels to know that you might have been wrong. I suppose I'm proud of you for trying. You helped some people. Chased a mystery. Got to kiss a pretty girl. But Alex, you're right back where you started. I know. Oh, you don't know anything, Alex. You don't even know you're not really here. What the fuck? I guess that's me. Case number 53322. Thrown down a... what? Twelve years ago, I made a mistake. The kind of thing that you... you can't undo. Alex... You know that I care about you. With everything that has happened... I just want what's best for you. These don't belong to Dr. Lin. A tuning peg.
Is that what I look like? Really? Hey, my guitar. Knock, knock. Um, Alex Chen? My guitar case has never heard of me. Sure. Huh. Alex. Gabe? <gasps> You're dead. So? Lots of people are dead, Alex. Most people. Where are we? I want to say... a hospital? Dr. Mendez to intensive care? Dr. Mendez to intensive care. Yep, definitely a hospital. <laughs> Gabe. Okay, here's what I do know. You are 10, I am 14. Our mother is sick, so is our father. But it's a different kind of sickness. Play your part. Gabe, why? I didn't do anything. Stop. Both of you. Dad. 
Behave. Alex, go check on your mother. Okay. She was right over there, waiting for me. Gabe told me it was full of needles. It scared me to death. We spent so much time in here that I basically memorized every article. There it is. The painting that taught me that art sucked sometimes. We couldn't afford a private room. Just got lucky, I guess. Gabe and I used to watch cartoons on this thing after school. Gabe? Alex? I need you to listen very carefully. We got some scary news today. And I'm going to be spending some time at the hospital. What? Mom? Are you okay? Hush now. It's going to be okay. Do you understand me? Things will be... different for a little while. But I am going to be okay. It was always too hot in this room. How many nights did Dad spend in this room, sleeping in an uncomfortable chair and eating vending machine dinners? There's something so weird and scary about watching your dad cry. Mom, every time I saw her, I worried it would be the last. Hi, Mom. 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 Such a brave girl. How do you ever get so brave? Is that how it went? You don't think you missed anything? Ow! Gabe, why? I didn't do anything. Stop. Both of you. Dad. Behave. <sighs> Alex, go check on your mother. Okay. Wait, did I miss something? No matter how much mom drank, her throat was always dry.
Hi, Mom. 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 Water, Alex. Get her some water. Thank you. You almost never cried, even when you were very small. Did you know that? That's been my biggest challenge with you. How do you take care of someone who is already so strong? No tears, my strong girl. I want you to make me a promise. Your brother, your father, they are going to need you. You have to be strong. Will you do that, Alex? <laughs> Such a brave girl. How do you ever get so brave? Oh, my God.